Okay, so the new Silent Hill 2 remake is coming out in a month or so, I think. So I decided we should go back to the original Silent Hill 2. This is the director's cut version of it. As you can see, we have the main scenario, Letter from si Silent Hill, and then a sub-scenario, Born from a Wish, which... I think the second scenario is where you play as James's wife, and then the first one is the original game. So we'll jump into it. Um, action level can be normal. Riddle level, I'm not that good with puzzles. I'm going to put it on easy, or else we're going to be here for a few years. Also, another thing to mention, I probably won't edit this video because I found with the Resident Evil video that it doesn't really work. So, this will probably be about a couple hours, if you like to spare some time. How's it going, James? Damn it, it's a Tuesday. Janitor hasn't come in to clean the bathroom recently. Or ever. I don't know if the floor is a red carpet or is just stained with so much blood it's Mary, become the carpet. Could you really be in this town? And now we start. Yeah. Games were killing it back in the early 2000s, especially 2001. Because, like, that opening cinematic, it's so simple, but it looks so cool. So good. Anyway, I'm just pouring a drink real quick. I've got to get myself my Silent Hill drink. Yeah. You get some nice and relaxing pouring sound before we go into the deep, dark, and desolate town of Silent Hill so we can get scared to fucking death. There's something on the wall and I can't read what it is. James, can you tell me what's on the... No? No, it's all over the fucking walls. Ah, well there's a toilet cubicle, a couple showers. I don't think they work anymore. Why did we go to the bathroom here? How do we get out? Aha! Ah, crap. That's a map. Hey James, where's the door? Is it this one? No, nope, that's a fucking map. Aha! <laughs> we could have been stuck there for a while. Don't doubt me and my need to not know where we're going. Crematorium. I got a letter. The name on the envelope says Mary. My wife's what? name. It's ridiculous. Couldn't possibly be true. Right, That's and why would it be untrue? Myself. A dead person can't write a letter. It could have got lost in the post. Disease three years ago. It got lost for a long time in the post. So then, why am I looking for her? Our special place. What could she mean? Well, what place was special to you in this? Fucking place. Does she Hunt mean the park on the lake? We spent the whole day there. 
Just the two of us staring at the water. Could Mary really be there? Is she really alive? Waiting for me? Oh, it'd be weird for her to be gone for three years and not say anything about it, don't you think, Mr. Sunderland? Alright, so we're starting. Um, there's a run button, is there? Yeah, it's square. I think... Let's check. This is our car, right? Well, it's the only car that's there. Makes sense. Check for anemones. Hey, a map. Good to see you picked a map, James. Anything in the trunk? Did you bring anything with you? No? Might have to start scavenging around. Check the mailbox. I don't trust this place one bit. Don't know who would consider Silent Hill their favourite place to go. It's like having a paid vacation to Midsummer. Not exactly a, a winning deal, if I say. Is there anything in this van? No? Okay, just tr try not to walk backward. To go forwards. Yes. We'll go to Luca Lake. Go to to Luca Lake. I just hear me occasionally take a drink every now and again just to add to the tension you can hear some water rustling sounds yeah imagine trying to do asmr in silent hill <laughs> someone's probably tried it but he was just like this is too scary what are you doing <laughs> yeah we're now going to have an asmr house tour of resident evil <clears throat> is walking around me. I heard footsteps. We're not, we're not even at the town yet and I'm already a bit tense. Maybe I should be running. <laughs> Maybe the game's trying to make me run. It's, it's playing all these sounds just to be like, hey, you, there could be anything out here, you know. Maybe you should be going faster. No, I want to make sure that my guy doesn't tire himself out. He's got a long walk ahead of him. He's uh, going out of sight. No, it's not okay. No, he's, he's okay, it's just someone's blown smog his way. The constant fog town. I don't think this is fog, I just think Silent Hill is a stoner town. That would make a lot more sense. <laughs> it's just a bunch of crack dens everywhere just blowing smoke out. <laughs> That's why it's so haunted. Everybody's constantly high. There's definitely something in the water. It hasn't tried to attack me yet. It's just making noises. Okay, I think we'll run. Getting a bit bored. We'll get James's cardio in. Oh, that's a... What's over here? Check down the well. Okay. What's that? Looking at this makes me feel like someone's groping around inside my skull. Like that villain check in the new Deadpool and Wolverine movie, or just theoretically? Gives me a weird feeling. Oh, first save file. Okay. Okay, so. We've ran into our first save file, and now we're good to head off. So even if we die, we'll just respawn in the well. So 
seems like we're the only one here at the moment. Where are we? Ah, yes, the cemetery. Our favourite place. Our secret place, even. Oh, hello. Excuse me. Oh, I'm sorry for sneaking up on you. It's just... I'm kind of lost. <laughs> Why are you here? <laughs> lost? It's for the both of you. Why are you here? Yeah. I'm looking for Silent Hill. Is this the right way? Um, yeah. It's hard to see with this fog, but... There's only the one road. You can't miss it. You can't get in either. But... Yes? I think you'd better stay away. This is... Uh, th this town... There's something wrong with it. It's kind of hard to explain, but... Is it dangerous? It's an apocalypse in there. You probably don't want to. Okay, I got it. I'll be careful. I'm not lying. No, I believe you. We're both kind of crazy to be here. I guess I really don't care if it's dangerous or not. I'm going to town either way. Ah, yes, and you're slightly suicidal. I'm looking for someone. Who is it? Someone. Very important to me. I'd do anything if I could be with her again. But she kind of died. Accident, really. For my mama. I mean, my mother. It's been so long since I've seen her. I thought my father and brother were here, but I can't find them either. Maybe we should check for the gravestones. Her, for her families and the it's not your no, thing, Mary. I hope you find them. Yeah, you too. You want to come with? We're less likely to die if we stick together. What is it? Oh, nothing. Sure, is quiet, quiet here, here, huh? I guess. <laughs> <laughs> nice to know that James is the socially awkward type. <laughs> Sorry to bother you, I'm just trying to to do some small talk. It's not really my thing. Mary says I was a very quiet person. <laughs> oh hey, a house. Anything in here? Or is this the Undertaker's house? Can we even get in? No. Are there any other doors? No? Okay. How about what's over here? Ah, cool. A gate. I think that's how we got in. We gotta go back to the road. If I can find it. No. Aha! Wait, 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 wait. I'm just being this way. Because that leads back up Lake Toluca Lake. So. We keep moving this way. I can see all this bloody fog. Must be that gate. That gate doesn't lead us up to bloody the boondocks again. I don't think. Oh, that's a pole, James. <laughs> Just be mindful of the telephone poles, since they don't look like they've been used for years. They're so shocking. Oh, hey, a truck. Is there anything in here? Got any weapons? Food? Drugs? I'll take drugs. And again, James must be on quite a few drugs to be here. Silent Hill Ranch. Ooh. Can we go in? 
No? Is this a foreclosure notice? Okay. We'll keep moving along. everywhere. Oh shit. It's a hill. Yes, James doesn't like hills. Yeah, we'll keep going down the road. I wonder if we get to find out what happened to the town and why the town turns out the way that it does. Questions that we'll probably answer later on, I hope. It seems interesting to just have a complete ghost town here. Um, no, there must be a gate somewhere. Hold on. Which one of these looks roughly like a gate? Oh, probably not either. I think we're supposed to go this way. Something's moving around out there. Oh, a gate! <laughs> <laughs> Might need to put some CRC on that bastard. What's in here? I can tell is whoever was building this room needs to be fired if they weren't already. It was completely unfinished. Unless this isn't supposed to be a room and this is a road. It's like it's built off the side of a cliff. It's hard to explain. But hey, we're nearly there, James. Silent Hill is just a few meters away. I hope you're happy. It's just bushes. <laughs> it's bushes arranged so it looks like something's jumping out at you with its claws out. <laughs> Scary stuff. When the bushes start laughing, that's when we need to have a problem. The Roadrunner. fan of the Wiley e. Coyote shorts. Pick up truck. Probably doesn't have anything in it. I guess we're here. So we just came down Waltzy Road. Now we can turn down Sanders Street. I have a map, don't I? I do, I do, okay. So, 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 so. There's something we've got to find first. So, to give context, I've played a little bit of this game already, but I only gotten up to I think the apartment bit so this part I'm kind of aware of what you're supposed to do but other than that it can get a bit dicey I guess whoever was left was pretty good at blocking the roads off put safety tape up and everything oh, hey a phone does it work Hello? Can I call my wife? No? Damn it. Communications must be jammed. What's that? There's nothing much at the moment. Okay, and... A bunch of other stuff as well. Yes, 
you can definitely feel the tension in the atmosphere as you walk around you see all these cars that don't have any owners vans that could move if you could get the keys to drive them what else do we have around here hey gate can i open it no figure out a way to open it if it ever wants to be opened no oh. are these marks for blood no it's just red paint oh bugger oh james how's your hand-to-hand -hand combat that shadow just now excuse me sir i'm looking for a woman named mary Sir? That son of a bitch moves quick. I'm running at full speed and he's already gone. I need more blood. I assume we just keep going down the road. That's where the blood trail is. Also, he was bleeding. He's bleeding very on and off, I say. There's large trails of blood, and then there's nothing for a few miles. Or maybe whoever caught them just kept smashing their face into the ground every now and again. Ooh. Warning. Watch speed. No worry, the only speed I'm going is jogging speed. We're not exactly running as quick as we can. What the fuck? Uh, something's going on. I have to pick up the radio, right? A police radio. Maybe I can now. I can moonlight as a cop. Oh shit. There it is. Oh James. Time to put that hand to hand to good use. Oh wait, we're just gonna pick up a plank. Okay. Alright you son of a bitch. Throw down. I've forgotten how to use this. I think you gotta hold. Turn. That's a good start. What the hell is it? Bash it a few more times to find out. Hey, do you want me to... No, it's not moving. I just want to make sure. Okay. Must be dead enough. I'll take that. Um, we picked up the radio, right? Oh, yeah. Yeah, good. This thing broken? Oh, hey. That sounds like my wife. Hello, honey. What the? Is this thing working? I better take it anyway. I might need it. Yeah, who knows? You might find somebody else with the other side of the receiver. Fucking desolate town. Oh crap, now there's blood all over my shoes. Okay, so now that we have a weapon, I'm pretty sure the enemies come out a lot more now. I think. So expect to see more of those goons sometime soon. 
There's a way to turn the radio on, isn't there? Got to keep the radio constantly on. Alright, that's pause. Okay, equipment. Should we adjust the volume? Eh, ah, that'll be alright. I'm pretty sure the radio is just constantly on, so if we start hearing static, that's when shit goes down. Oh, I can run and hit. Go figure. Oh, hey, speaking of. Hello, first victim. Ah, oh, you son of a bitch! Go down. Yeah. Bash it till it stops moving. Are you done? Okay. I think we hit it hard enough. <laughs> you gotta be careful with those with those nippers. I call them nippers because they start crawling around and they nip your feet. Um, now, oh, that's a tree as well. Be mindful of the trees, Mr. Sunderland. Oh, fuck, there's another one somewhere. It's close, but not close enough to be a problem. Oh, I'm really looking in on one, aren't I? Oh no, there he is. Uh, I don't need to worry about you yet. Mm. Can I get in here? No. It's a car blocking the way. Damn it. Um. Now what was I looking at? <laughs> oh! You cheeky little shit! <laughs> okay, I'm gonna fucking whack you. Whack it harder. Okay, you got me with that one. <laughs> little fucker. Hiding under the van. Waiting for the perfect opportunity to strike. Now I'm on edge. <laughs> Uh, yeah, plays horror game, gets scared when jump scared. Curses game when he wonders why he got jump scared in a horror game. Oh, fuck, who's this guy? Who was he, anyway? Probably the guy who got dragged around the fucking place. Anyway, we grab the apartment key from him. Whatever the fuck the apartment key is. Were we even supposed to be down here? <laughs> Well, I guess we had to get the apartment key somehow. Okay. I said I'd play two hours of this. Who knows? I might just whimper out and play one. Oh. Okay. Walls are closing in. map though. Where am I? Okay. Yeah, he's marking off all the places that you can't get through. Um, I think there was something on Saul Street we can check. If I remember how we fucking get there. Uh oh. Nope. Don't want anything to do with you. Let me check this map real quick. Okay, we're going the right way. So yeah, it's a left turn, then a right turn, and then we might be able to find the thing I'm trying to look for. That's not those bloody things. 
Nope. Nope. Ah, oh, crap. Ran straight into him. There's another one. There's another one over there. Don't do something down here. No, it's a car. Aha! Camper van. Okay, James, take your battered, bruised bones to the save point. We can save the game and keep moving forward. Uh, how are you holding up so far? <laughs> I'm holding up great. Oh, goddamn power alarm. No, don't worry. That's just someone getting robbed outside. It's not the game. It'll probably die down soon enough. There's a memo lying on the sol on the sofa. I'll wait at Bar Neely's. Alright, Neely's Bar on Neely Street. I copied it onto my own map. So now we have a place to go. And an apartment key that I don't know how to use. Or if I should be using it. How are we getting to Neely's? Oh, yeah. Down the street, turn left, straight past the Happy Burger. Happy Burger seems like a pretty stupid name right around now. Drive left. Is there a guy still in the middle of the street? Yep. Kind of. Just a bit off the street. Stop trying to scare the piss out of me while I check my map. Ah, oh, great. Fight or flight, ow! That's it, James! Just look in its general direction and bash it until it stops moving. Or stops making noises. Stop making noises yet, therefore it's not fucking dead. Is it? Oh, crap, not another one. Where's this freaking bar? Is it this place? Must be. Okay. There's some things I remember about it, like going to the bar. But there's also small things like where it is that I can't remember. Am I supposed to look at this? There's a map here, yeah. Something at the end of the street between Nathan's Avenue and Neely Street? <laughs> ah yes, in the apartment complex. There was a hole here. It's gone now. Okay. Anything else I need to know? <laughs> there is a ghoul here. He's here now. But still. I guess we have to check out that thing at the end of the street. What's that? Did he knock it down? Oh no. We can't check it out. There's nowhere to get to Nathan Avenue. But thanks to the apartment key, we can get to Woodside Avenue Apartments. Woodside Avenue Apartments. No! <laughs> to the ghoul and to the motorcyclist. What the hell's in here? Oh, health pack? 
Got a first aid kit. Do we need that at the- oh wait, that's the wrong fucking button. I'm always used to triangle being the inventory menu. I'm looking gear here, yeah, found in town. Oh, we've got one first aid kit. So we've currently got. Can't get in there, even though we could just break a window and be done with it. Oh, shit! Is that another one that crawls out of a freaking car? Something is, like, closing in on me. <laughs> I don't like it. Oh, there he is. Smack it. Smack it like it owes you money, James. No, now it's gonna... Okay, I'm getting the fuck out of here. Uh, not that way. Can't control your way around. Am I even in the right spot? I'm close to the right spot. It's just getting inside. While getting piss scared. What the hell is that thing? Well, I'm in now. I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing, but I'm in now. I'm getting fucking bitten by everything. Spat at. Why am I here? Why am I doing this? Um, I might use it. Yeah. Hopefully we'll find more first aid kits, but he was looking a bit... A bit destroyed, we should say. Seems quaint enough, even if we need some lights. I got a map of the apartment block. Excellent. Now we don't have to wander around aimlessly. Right, James? Is there anything up there you can check? Oh, there's a save point. Not a bad idea, game. Yeah, fuck trying to get through here again. Um, is there anything I can... I'm just scavenging at this point. Just checking every point to make sure that I can... As if there's anything that I can grab. Oh, that's locked. Oh well. Don't need to go through there, I guess. Is that door okay vigilance is key so this is where shit gets scary right out the gate i can't tell if the motherfucker's behind us but if we go straight to a wall haha now i catch up to you you son of a bitch you don't see me coming Oh, motherfucker. Come here. Yeah, that's the thing. You get back up, and then I have to smash you again. Hit it until it dies. Okay. Good work, Japs. As long as nothing else snuck up on us. What's this? Nothing? It's too... Oh, yeah. So, the only way we can read the map... Fuck. 
that's just my reflection. <laughs> Nothing to see here yet. But anyway, the only way you can read the map in this bit is if you go to these little pockets of light to read it, which is pretty cool detail. Because, yes, if you can't read a map in the dark, how do you expect to... Okay, so lock's broken there. Lock's broken there. Can I fucking... How do I turn the camera again? There's a fucking way to center the camera. I've forgotten what it was. There's a fucking way to center it. Mainly because I don't know if something walking towards me. Ah, there we go. Got you now. You can do your little dance all you want. All I have to do is sit here and keep doing this. And then... Fuck. That's how you're going to go. No, fuck it. If he's going to be down there, let him be down there. No, I can't get that door open. That fuck is still dead. I know. <laughs> Should we kick it to see if it's still dead? Okay, where the hell are we now? Ooh, flashlight. What's that in the background? I think that's a fiend. Hold up. Grab it. Hello! I knew you were there. I, ow! Smack it, James. I know you don't have any combat experience, but smack the thing with legs. Smack it. So, stop, stop whacking the air. This. Just keep going, James. You don't know if that it stops moving until it stops squirming. And screaming. Okay. I think we're done. <laughs> Wait till the fuckers start popping up. That'll be happening in the remake. It'll just be you smack that smack there. We're like, okay, I think we've got it now. The legs will fucking pop up. Grab you around the neck and choke you to death. Let's see, that's probably what's going to happen in the remake, knowing my luck. <laughs> and unfortunately, I'll be there. Um, anything in the kitchen? Well, other than me, no? Okay, good. I've got my flashlight, so no worries here. No other doors that I can open. Which side is it? I think it is that. Wait. Didn't I just come from this room? No, I haven't. Have I? I'm about to find out really quickly, aren't I? Ah, yes, I have. This side. I'm going to check the thing, but I'm pretty sure... Oh, yes. I think I'm slightly dying. Let me check the map real quick. I keep turning the wrong direction. I'm pretty sure the guy who hates my guts is that way. Alright, lock's broken on that one. What the fuck's in here? There's a trash chute. There's some kind of strange garbage stuck in the hole. Maybe if I drop something heavy from above. 
Not a bad idea. Um, turn yourself back around. Let's check these other rooms. Oh, that one's locked. Gotta give it to these dead silent hell resident guests. They sure know how to lock their rooms before they mysteriously disappear. I forget to lock my apartment. That gets shitty. Uh oh. Where? There. Can't really be fighting him right now, can I? Oh, I don't have a choice. That lock's broken. Oh hey, an open door. I don't know if I should be happy about this or... Fucking concerned! Oh, my radio hasn't gone off yet, so who knows? Maybe I'm not completely boned yet. Television. There's nothing unusual about it. Other than the fact that it's an old as fuck television. But hey, it is 2001. This game would have been played on a television like that. There's a newspaper here, it looks like it's very old. Thank you for that insight, Mr. Sunderland. Think you can tell us anything else? I'm gonna stay vigilant, wait. Oh, a clock. I think this clock is useful later on. The clock is stopped at 2.07 and 15 seconds. The faceplate is closed. It is locked. I can't touch the needles of the clock like this. Okay. Is there anything else I can figure out? In... Check it, check it for corpses. If you see any corpses, that means it's going to pop up and start fucking us up. Oh yeah, check the inventory as well. What do we have? Radio, photo of Mary, letter from Mary. Okay. Yeah, we haven't found any... Um, haven't found any first aid kits or anything else that could assist us. I am hearing a lot of ambient noise. <laughs> Can the composer stop trying to freak me out? It's unsettling. <laughs> I know you're a horror game, but be less horrifying. <laughs> Imagine that as a request. Um, anyway. No. There's nothing over there at the moment. Or something. Yeah, so I can't get to room 209. Yeah, so the rooms that I can go into, it's 205, 208. Can we go into room 202? Did we go into room 202? Fuck, that's right, the fucker followed me down. I'm not gonna like this, am I? I'm gonna need a bolt like the Deccans, or I wait for him to come up to me. Well, that's probably why I haven't gone to room 202. We're too busy dealing with this fucker. Hello? Have you woken up? Oh no, he's walking the other way. Good. Fuck. Okay, never mind. Route 202 is a bust. I'm gonna go this way then. No, 
Anyway, that's for the garbage chute. I know about that. Just a normal washing machine. There's nothing of interest here. Look away, people. Nothing to see. Locked. I'm trying to get into one of the rooms, aren't I? I'm looking for the door that leads to the stairs. That one. Might have already been here, though. You fucking, I hate you, game. Really starting to hate you and your shit. There's a key on the ground on the other side of the bars. If I stretch my arm out, I just might be able to reach it. Yeah, why not, James? Go for it. What's the worst thing that could happen? You might get scared by someone. It's a little further. Or maybe if you've got one of those, like, claw arms. Ow. He bitch! <laughs> this is why I hate kids. I mean, moving on. Hmm. Is it me or does this floor look worse than the last floor? Lock's broken. Less rooms or what? Ah, that's probably why it's got less rooms. Gotta make my way to the other side. What's in here? Trouble? Okay. James, ready for anything, remember? Even that shopping trolley. Oh cool, a handgun. <laughs> Alright, you guys are fucked now. <laughs> Gonna rock up with my gun and shoot you in the face. This wall is pockmarked with gunshots. Okay, what's that thing on the ground next to the wall? Never mind. I have a gun now. Lock's broken. This is still a kitchen. I don't know what this place looked like before it turned into a shithole, but I'm hoping it was a metropolis. Because I'm still trying to figure out the reasons as to, as to why people lived here. Then again, there's people living in Rotorua, and I don't know why they're living there. <laughs> I'm not anymore, that's for sure. Um, can we try reach for the key again, or what? I can't reach for it no matter how far I stretch, but who's that kid? I don't know. A distant relative of yours? Hmm. Wait, did I check all the doors? I don't think I checked everywhere in 301. Fucking monster up here with me, isn't there? Maybe it's the game working in its own favour to make me extremely paranoid. Not that it takes me a lot to be paranoid, but anyway, aside from that fact, I'm even making you paranoid by crinkling my chair. Yes, I know it's pockmarked with gunshots. I can't open any of these fracking doors. Um, anything in the shopping trolley? Like, in the actual thing? No? Okay. I think it would be best to leave for now.
I have to get over to room to that other side of the room. I'm not 100% sure how I'm going to do it, so... Yeah. I'm starting to think I do have short-term memory loss. Well, then again, I think when I play things, because, like, I have played past this part, but I'm not 100% sure how I did it. It'll probably come back to me once I've done it, but... I think I play it the first time to see if I like it, and then the second time is when I start noticing shit. It's like, oh, so this this is why you do this, so that's why this happens. It's also the same with movies as well. Like, I watch the movies the first time to see if I enjoy it, and then I start really following plot points and character motivations and all that stuff on the second and third watches. with everyone as well anyway been through no we haven't been through this bit because that bit's locked but I think we can get to the apartment from the other side because there's two ways into the apartment there's that one there and then there's an entrance on the other side of the complex Very last door. Yes, just stop running into the fucking <laughs> the gate, James. <laughs> yeah, sorry. James is slightly traumatized from what he has witnessed, and also might be mildly drunk. Fuck. There's a way to get in there. there probably is. I probably have to walk around Silent Hill more. I can figure out where the fuck I'm going. Because there's a way to open that door. We only have one of the apartment keys, right? Yeah, fuck. There's an alleyway that's just over here. Hello? Anything want to pop up and say hi? No, just garbage. No, I'm feeling valued. health drink. Excellent. I might have to use it now, actually. Shit. Wrong button. Still using triangle. Yeah. Now he feels less dead. Still dead inside, but, you know, can't fix that overnight. Uh, that's the door that's fucking locked. Vigilance for safety. What's this on the wall here? Just a normal washing machine. <laughs> Not the washing machine, you get the thing on top of the washing machine. The thing is. Oh fuck, we haven't checked room 210, have we? Room 210 might be the answer to all of our questions. If we can just get over there without anything jumping at us. That's why it's something you'll come busting through the walls. Aha! An open door. Oh no! An open door! Something's in here! Yep. Turn! Turn! Yeah. 
You want to start with the overhead attacks. You can't tell me it's fucking dead. I have to hit it more, don't I? Never mind. What's that? Handgun bullets. Excellent. Are you sure you don't want me to kick it a few times? Oh, fuck. <laughs> That's how we got in. Okay. Yeah, there's still a few rooms we have to check, James. We can't just leave as much as I would like to. We can't just leave yet. Okay. That's the door then. Where the fuck is that? No, that's the guy we just beat to fucking death. I think that's a closet. This is just a bit as well. Um, no, this is the kitchen. It's nothing of value, I guess. Right, James? You seem to like saying that a lot. This just seems like an ordinary apartment block with an ordinary monster lurking in it. And this is just an ordinary monster's bedroom. With handgun bullets. couple of the doors too. <laughs> I feel the most tense lurking around in this room in particular. I don't know why. Maybe I feel weird about it. Maybe this is the room where I feel like I'll be done in. Just get that defensive stance. Remember what you were taught. <laughs> what do you mean you weren't taught martial arts? Maybe something will lurk out of the toilet. <laughs> Wasn't that a Japanese folk lore or something? I wouldn't say folklore, but an old Japanese bedtime story where they were just like, if you, if you're a very naughty person, something will jump out of the toilet and pull you under or something. Wouldn't surprise me if someone decided to that into the game. But yeah, I'm still not finding what I'm looking for. Not that I know what I'm looking for. I'm just fucking hoping I can get something of value in here. That was the second bathroom. Look at this guy rocking two bathrooms. What a rich person. God, it was a fuck ton of handgun bullets. And a bunch of empty closets. <laughs> uh, is there any other place I haven't checked? Maybe I didn't check 208 as thoroughly as I wanted to. I think I've checked this place. I, I'll just do one more sleep, sweep of the main hall. Yes, that's the bathroom. Been in there. <laughs> About three times now. Nothing on the shelves. Anything on the couch? No. Not that I think we can get over there. Fucking table's blocking the way. But yeah, if Mr. Mutant isn't going to jump back up, then I say we move along. Maybe room 208 will give us something to, to look for. Yeah. That's the only thing about unedited videos. This is, all this part doesn't get cut out, which, yeah, I apologise, but um, I felt like it was better for us to be immersed in the Silent Hill scene, in a way. So we can feel the tension together. What the fuck was that? <laughs> Shit. <laughs> 
no joke, that genuinely scared the shit out of me to the point that I thought it was someone outside. <laughs> I had the game, I had to have the game reassure me, just like, no, this is something in the game. Fucking hell. Okay. I think the better question is, am I going to make it to the two hour mark? <laughs> I don't think I will. I have to start changing this to alcohol. <laughs> no, and I'll be la more loud, more scared, but hey, I'll be less paranoid. <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ. Ah, okay. Some kind of noise in here. I guess the question is, where the fuck is the noise coming from? <laughs> Let's play this planet goddamn horror game. Hmm. Is the radio one? It's not spazzing the fuck out yet, so keep your wits about ya. That was not on before. What the hell? You were not here before. Hey, it kind of looks like you. He's dead. Who could have done this? I don't know. <laughs> not only was the TV not on before this, but he wasn't here. <laughs> Can I check the TV? Can I check his room? Okay, not nice. Phone, can we call the cops? <laughs> this note, it must be from the person who lived here. What does it say? I can't read that. Three different sizes, time on the run, three young men circling round the sun. Henry is short and very, very slow. Scott can't stop. He's always on the go. Well, I guess that's riddles on easy, so if I can't figure the, this out, then God knows what it's going to be like on medium or hard. Has that got something to do with the clock? Do I want to be in this fucking room with the clock? <laughs> so there's something written on here, isn't there? The scars from the past shall remove the nail that stops time. How hard to push it doesn't move, it's like it's stuck to the ground. Okay. This plan is locked. I can't touch the needles of the clock like this. Okay. There's a way to get the clock moving. <laughs> Scared, I should say. Because every time I hear that static, I think like my radio's going off. I mean, what? I'm pretty sure there's nothing in here. R right? <laughs> Three different sizes, time on the run, three young men circling around the sun. Henry is short and very, very slow. Scott can't stop, he's always on the go. fucking theme when you come over to this bit. Um. 
I didn't pick anything else up, did I? No, handgun bullets, plank, light, radio, photo of Mary, letter from Mary. Ooh, okay. Um. You know what? <laughs> Unless something else happens, I'm going to do one more sweep of the rooms and then I might end it here. I'll try to figure out what the fuck's going on. Oh, God, the thing's back, isn't he? Not going that way. Ah, oh, hello. Should I wait? Or should I not wait? Probably not wait. He seems busy trying to find me. Let's not let him do that. to be of use. Can we grab the sewing machine? Wait, what was that? There are arms and legs scattered all over the sofa. Luckily they came from the mannequin. You don't know that, James. I wouldn't say there's any luck involved in this place. Check 205, 208. Um, 202 isn't going to open unless we grab something in particular, right? So I'm going to, I'm going to check 2010. Not 2010, 210. <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> It's four legs. Is there any? No. No. There's no, there's no reason, is there? If we, because if we, if we go, if we try and go after four legs, we're just going to be going at two rooms that are locked. We can't go down there. So, nah, fuck you four legs. I'm going back this way. Have fun standing there being God knows what. I'd rather go talk to Mr. Spitty over here. Hello, Mr. Spitty. Can I just go back into a room I've already checked? Oh no. I'm back here. Okay. Check the check the top floor again just to make a hundred percent sure. Bad game to be playing when you're all alone on a, on a Saturday night. Which means it's a thing. Silent Hill Saturdays. Just until the new Silent Hill 2 comes out. Then I'll really hate myself when I play it. And you're still telling me this door's locked? Locked broken. That doesn't help. What I'll do is I'll go down, save the game, and then we can come back to this next time. <laughs> Just so that I can regain some of my sanity. 
whatever sanity I had left was not the games I'm doing. Anyway. Because you can't get into 302 and then we've got to get over there somehow. But yeah, we can we can figure that all out later. I'm just gonna get us back. What the hell? Yeah, I don't like the sound of that one bit. I don't like this place one bit. I probably have to walk around the town to find another key, right? That's probably where the thing is. Maybe I have to go back to Neely's bar. It's probably something I missed over there. But anyway. We can come back to that later. Right now, where the fuck is my save point? There it is. Well, this wasn't two hours long, but anyway, I'll see you guys next Saturday for Silent Hill Saturday. At least until Silent Hill 2 Remake comes out. Yeah, we'll override it again. Anyway, catch you later.